Not too long ago, we went over to the Sway LA house and did a giant liquid nitrogen experiment. We mixed 32 gallons of boiling hot water, washable paint, and soap with 120 liters of liquid nitrogen. The result was, well, pretty incredible and much larger than I anticipated. One thing that was super cool was that the reaction was so cold that it froze the foam actually like in place, kind of like a frozen foam fossil. The reaction was so cold that it contracted the container we were using to the point of failure, meaning we cracked and destroyed our giant water tank. This could have happened when the boiling hot water hit the liquid nitrogen and made the container expand too quickly as well. And while this experiment was insanely impressive the first time we did it, I mentioned this to David Dobrik and he immediately said, that's awesome, let's go bigger. So here's what we're gonna do to make this reaction even bigger and better. We noticed at the end of the experiment last time, there was plenty of liquid nitrogen at the bottom of the container, indicating that we probably could have used more of our second reactant, which is boiling hot water. So this time around, we're gonna use a 55 gallon drum and get close to doubling the amount of boiling water we used last time. Couple little additions to this build from the last one. We've added these little carabiners on the side. We're also using metal wire to pull. One of the big things that we noticed from last time is that when we pulled with the rope, there was a lot of give. And that give actually almost made the whole thing topple over. Another sort of thing that we've now doubled up on is that we've made this a lot longer and we've reinforced this area quite a bit. Because a 55 gallon drum, with that totally full, that's right around 450 pounds. And so that's a lot of weight for this really dodgy lifeguard stand that we got from David years ago. So we've, we've added a little bit more structural support too throughout the lifeguard stand. And we've just made everything more robust in general. Also, this reaction works because of the temperature differential between the boiling hot water at 212 degrees and the liquid nitrogen at negative 321 degrees. When the water comes into contact with the liquid nitrogen, it is instantly vaporized. Some of the water vapor gets pushed into the soap, creating foam. At the same time, the water vapor is creating pressure inside the water tank, which forces out both the newly formed cloud and the colored foam. And just to make sure that we're going as big as we can, we're gonna come close to doubling the amount of liquid nitrogen that we used last time. We're also gonna make sure that the liquid nitrogen we're using doesn't evaporate too quickly. To combat this, we're gonna insulate our new holding device with foam board and cover it with our old cracked container. The result? should be super impressive. So let's get started. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is your doorway now. <laughs> Woo! We're in the house. We made it. <laughs> cool. Nitrogen in there, water up here. What we're gonna do now is we're going to boil all the water. We're gonna add all the soap and the washable paint. We're going with blue this time. One gallon per container. The biggest concern is cracking the container. If we crack the container, there is no experiment. And so that is mostly what I am worried about. Liquid nitrogen holding device. Let's come in a little more. Get your pants on. Set the number one priority. Set it. <laughs> Sometimes it's priority. <laughs> All right, so let's just go ahead and corral everybody up here really quick. Nick, be, be honest. Is this, this isn't gonna stay in the house? We define stain. I mean, it's <laughs> right underneath the balcony. The first thing I thought was that balcony's gonna be. Bro, and look at that. that if that's a little Whoa. sample of it right there, that looks like it's gonna stay in the house. Wherever the wind blows, that's where it's gonna blow everything. <laughs> it literally blows it's going this way. I need four volunteers that are tall and that are strong. Yeah, yeah, tall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four. You want to be an editor? Yeah. All right. All right, Todd, we'll bring you in. We will need all hands that are tall enough, basically like over five feet. Wait, Sorry. <laughs> right, don't worry about it. I'm five feet on the dock. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Everyone I just pointed at, you're gonna pour. So here's how this logistically works. We're gonna start shuttling 
the, the blue liquid, we're gonna shuttle that into the 55 gallon drum. As soon as that happens, like the clock has started, like we have to like move as fast as possible. The very last bucket that goes into the 55 gallon drum, we then, as soon as that happens, everybody that just pointed at, all 10 of us, we're gonna pour 200 liters of liquid nitrogen into this big container here. Now the reason that has to go super fast, as fast as we possibly can, is because that container wasn't really meant to hold liquid nitrogen, so it's gonna shrink, and if it shrinks too much, it will crack. Let's grab another one. Grab the other one. Oh yeah. Alright, go this way, Jason. Move it. We need somebody on the other side. We need people over here. Alright, here we go. Alright, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Alright, pull on this side. Let's do this one. Ready? I'll go this. Wait, wait, wait. One more. Ready? Pull. Okay, here we go. Pull this one. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop, 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 drop. That was crazy. That was, awesome. that was really cool. <laughs> it definitely got caught in the wind. There was definitely some lateral motion there, but the volume was much larger than when we did at the Sway LA House. So for that reason, I feel like it was a total success. Um, we're just gonna have to get into some cleanup real quick. You see. That was the world's largest liquid nitrogen mega reaction. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you really soon.